Hey everybody, this is Raquel Reed and this is my hip spotlight. Raquel Reed, we're paying you to come down to the lobby of theater, right? <laughs> I actually always wanted to be a singer, but it didn't just happen that way. I actually was living in Hollywood and it more came about modeling, and so I've been doing that for the past seven, eight years now, and that's a means of money for me. Singing didn't come as easy because I didn't have the right connections or anything, and I didn't fall right into that. I fell into um, publications and getting print work and doing that, and that came a lot more easier. Everyone thinks that I'm, you know, this kind of really eccentric, like I'm always going out partying and this and that, and you know, my life's wild, and my friends are always like, you look like the most wild person that I would ever meet, and I introduce you to my friends, and you know, I'm, you just look like someone I would never be friends with, but realistically, my life is, I'm very, very normal, and I'm very, my friends call me an old lady. I don't go out. I go to work, I come home, I try and record, and then I go to bed, and then sometimes occasionally I have a modeling job or go do makeup somewhere, and then I just do it all over again. So I do see things in a whole different light, I wanna say, like I've always seen things in color, like that always stood out to me, even if I'm just outside or anything like that. And I'm a very coordinated person. I've always been like that too, like I guess I'm like, a two-year-old in my head just always matching colors and doing that but I see that with everything that I do so I'm a very visual person absolutely to hook up with Mario it's weird how like you start seeing that you have connections in your life it's like you know all these people but what do they actually do like you know you really have to like go into people's lives and be like oh so what do you do for a living you have all these people around you especially if you live in a recording studio, there's just always people who do jobs that are kind of involved in that. So it's weird how it just comes all together so easy. You're just like, wow, like you do this, you make music videos, you do this. And then it's just like, wow, so we can do this on, you know, this budget. And it's like, wow, we can actually do this. So it actually just fell right in my hands. I got really lucky. Sometimes I get very lucky <laughs> to say. I want my videos to be brighter and brighter and brighter. I'm all about color and punch and I'm still learning about film and filming and all that and what ways I can do to get it the exact way that I want. So I'm just hoping in the future I'll get the exact result that I'm looking for. Me, Adam and Chris is a good, good threesome. <laughs> it's very good. He actually came up with all the drums in Fast Lane. He does a, a lot of the songs even if he's not there in the studio with us, we send him the song, he'll do it, and then we'll send it right back to us, and we're just blown away. He'll do it in like an hour. All right. Well, you could find me all over the internet if you Google my name, Raquel Reed, or you can look on Twitter, I Hate Raquel Reed, and I Hate Raquel Reed is my website because everyone hates everybody, especially me. So. <laughs> You can find me on there. If you go on iTunes, put in Raquel Reed and buy all my singles and just keep supporting. Hello. Hello.